Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study how we can traverse binary trees. There are three ways to traverse a binary tree T whose root is R. A binary tree T with root R can be traversed in in order. It can be traversed in pre-order. It can be traversed in post-order. In pre-order traversal, of binary tree T whose root is R. First, root R is processed. Then, left subtree of root R is traversed in pre-order. And after this, right subtree of root R is traversed in pre-order. In in-order traversal of binary tree T whose root is R, first, left subtree of root R is traversed in in order then root r is processed and after this right subtree of root r is traversed in in order in post order traversal of binary tree t whose root is r first left subtree of root R is traversed in post order. Then right subtree of root R is traversed in post order. And after this root R is processed. Now see this binary tree T. Root of this binary tree T is A. In pre-order traversal of this binary tree T. First, root A is processed. Then, left subtree of root A is traversed in pre-order. And then, right subtree of root A is traversed in pre-order. So, first of all, root A will be processed. Now, after this, left subtree of root A is traversed in pre-order. B is the root of left subtree of root A. So B will be processed. Then left subtree of node B will be traversed in pre-order. Left subtree of node B has only one node that is D. So D will be processed. And after this, right subtree of node B will be traversed in pre-order. Right subtree of node B has only one node, that is node E. So, node E will be processed. After this, right subtree of root A will be traversed in pre-order. Node C is the root of right subtree of node A. So, node C will be processed and after this left subtree of node C will be traversed in pre-order. Left subtree of node C contains only one node that is node F. So node F will be processed and after this right subtree of node C will be traversed in pre-order. Right subtree of node C contains only one node that is node G. So node G will be processed. Now see the in order traversal of this binary tree T. Root of this binary tree T is A. First, left subtree of root A will be traversed in in order. Then root A will be processed. And then right subtree of root A will be traversed in in order. So, first we will traverse left subtree of node A in in order. B 
is the root of left subtree of node A. So, first we will traverse left subtree of node B in in order. Left subtree of node B has only one node that is node D. So, D will be processed. After that, node B will be processed and then right subtree of node B will be traversed in in order. Right subtree of node B has only one node that is node E. So, node E will be processed. After this, after this in order traversal of left subtree of node A, node A is processed and after this right subtree of node A is traversed in in order. Root of right subtree of node A is node C. So first left subtree of node C will be traversed in in order. Left subtree of node C contains only one node that is F. So node F will be processed. After this node C will be processed and after this right subtree of node C will be traversed in in order. Right subtree of node C contains only one node that is node G. So node G will be processed. Now see the post order traversal of this binary tree T. Here A is the root of binary tree T. First left subtree of root A is traversed in post order. B is the root of left subtree of node A. So we will traverse left subtree of node B in post order. Left subtree of node B has only one node that is node D. So node D will be processed. After this right subtree of node B will be traversed in post order. Right subtree of node B has only one node that is node E. So node E will be processed. After this node B will be processed. After the post order traversal of left subtree of node A, right subtree of node A will be traversed in post order. Node C is the root of right subtree of node A. So we will traverse left subtree of node C in post order. Left subtree of node C has only one node that is node F. So node F will be processed. After this right subtree of node C will be traversed in post order. Right subtree of node C has only one node G. So node G will be processed and then node C will be processed. After the post order traversal of right subtree of node A, node A will be processed. Thank you very much.